what's going on you guys and welcome to another video hope you guys are having a great day today so as you guys can kind of see by the title of the video today is not going to be a very good topic to talk about um and i think it's kind of raining outside but yeah ahmad got some bad news he totaled his 335 is and it is not good at all so I'm actually heading on over to his house right now and it's in his garage and it's not open right now we'll have him open it see what it looks like and i'll have him explain to you guys what happened i can't believe it happened when i heard about it i honestly thought he was pranking me or something and he sh sent me pictures and i could not believe it like i literally i was like this is a joke his garage is still closed so let's text him here we go You want to put a shirt on? Huh? You want to put a shirt on? <laughs> this is so bad. Oh, um... Wasn't your engine, like, kind of, or your cover was open or something? Like, right there. See the timing chain? Timing chain and everything. Jeez. Is this your subframe right here? Mm -hmm. Wow. Like, that is pretty bad. You want to tell them what happened or what? Hmm? You want to tell them what happened or what? Pretty much it was raining and I was, uh, was just switching lanes to get over. And uh, I've never hydroplaned before, so I didn't actually know what was going on. So I thought I was just gonna, I was just gonna be able to catch it again. But um, yeah, once I got into the grass, there was no, there was no catch in it, and then uh, um, just slapped a electrical pole. You don't have any photos of you in the pole, or uh, the pole at all. No, not the pole. I don't have photos of the pole at all. Wait, did this come off, or did you take this off? Yeah, it blew off. Uh, it blew off. I never even saw it. What about your other side? Never even saw it. Same thing. I never even saw it. That, the passenger window blew out. Wait, what? Yeah, it blew out. Blew out? Mm -hmm. Like it like shot out? Yeah, it just poof, like disintegrated. Holy cow. Airbags. And then I guess he went to the tow company or something and they also did his rear bumper. Or it was right here. Yeah, they like bash my uh, tail light. This was completely fine. Yeah, don't leave your cars at tow yards. They'll they'll treat your car like crap. But other than that, that's pretty much it. Um, Just that front suspension. Oh, he has B suit coils, and one of them was bent, so that pretty much. Yeah, they're gone. Um, so I won't be able to take them off and like you know sell them or anything. Uh, the we looked in the engine bay and stuff. The motor mounts were cracked. I don't know if I told you the motor mount. Nah, you didn't tell me that. Jeez. Is it possible to open this or nah? Yeah. You can open it? Have you tried? Hold on. So I got I put some bullshit in there. Do you want me to move it? Like I just threw this in there because this is just this is not even supposed to be in there. Oh, it's no big deal. Oh, I can see your turbo from here. Jeez. It looks like somebody <laughs> ran into a pole. <laughs> Is this your charge pipe right here? Mm -hmm. Well, that didn't that too. So what now? Are you gonna look for another BMW or what? Whoa. I don't know. What do you mean? Uh, I don't know. There's a bunch of options out there. Jeez, that was loud. Uh, I don't know how much money they're gonna give me for this, but so far they already kind of are trying to lowball me on it. So. Uh, like for example, the amount of money they're giving me for this right now um, won't even like pay for another one of these. So that's kind of lame. Whoa! What is this right here? Is this your? Uh... I'm not gonna lie. That's not. That's right why now. you guys can't trust anybody. I'm pretty sure that I don't think that broke during the crash. I think the tow truck company tried to uh, tow from there. Um, it's it not even great says on. there's a sticker right there that says. Do not tow or lash axle. Try to feel what Phil is. But yeah, 
but yeah. Wow, is that one snapped too? No, that one's good. Oh, you can't even see it. Oh, you can't even see it, yeah. Um, there's oil, there's fuel right there. His baby. How much were you making before? 500. 500 exactly? Yeah, 500. I just got new injectors too from the dealership, so it was just starting to run better. And then I was going to get the, uh, the auxiliary fuel too, just came in the same day. Your windshield cracked? Is this from the crash as well, or? Yeah, I don't know. It's weird, dude, how like things happen. Like that passenger side window blew out. My window was fine. Uh, the f the windshield cracked. Might have been impact kind of went on the left side because you know this is kind of like it followed like that. Yeah, almost. maybe like the, like I I don't know how it works, but maybe like shock waves just cause, yeah. Because like you could see, like, like, you could see the like, angle. It was yeah. Like this. It's at 40 miles an hour. You were going 40? Mm -hmm. And then it happened? This all happened at like 40 miles an hour, everything. So you gotta be careful. It could happen anytime, any place. Well, how, how, how hard was it raining? Um, honestly, it started to slow down. It was just a lot. There was I like, felt like in the street, I probably could have been like fine, but it kind of just kept going into the grass. And once it was in the grass, I really couldn't... Uh, uh, it just kind of kept going like straight into the pole, but yeah, like 40, uh, 40, maybe 40, 45 to 50 miles an hour tops. Mm -hmm. Like you can't even tell it's a BMW right here. Um, uh, if that emblem wasn't there, you would not be able to tell this is a BMW. <laughs> Unless I go to the side, maybe let's try this. You, you want to move? But anyways, so what's happening right now is that we have a tow truck coming to pick it up right now to pick it up and take it out of the garage on Jot's 335i, which is right over there. Doesn't work still as you guys saw in the previous video. Flashback. We think it's the Valvetronic, right? Valvetronic, what it motor? motor. Um, so they're gonna go ahead and fix that, but it's still parked on the side, and they can't really do anything until they move the 335 IS out of it. How are they gonna? Are they just gonna pick it up and drag just? It, yeah. Are you, they're gonna drag it? Just straight drag it, yeah. Because the car doesn't, it won't crank on, and it won't go into neutral unless it's on. This is your baby, dude. Yep. Yeah. Blood, sweat, and tears, money. Yep. Just like that. Um, so when you crashed, um, did it hurt? Nah. It hurt a little bit after. How'd the airbags feel like, for real? Did it, like, hurt? That's what everybody says. Uh, Where'd it hit you? Oh, well, I was driving, because I was driving with, like, two hands, and then when that started to happen, like, my, you know, my grip gets tighter with two hands anyway, so, like, I was just sitting back like this, so when the airbag like blew up, it's not like because my face hit the steering wheel. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? It's just because I guess the sensors went off and then um, it just blew the airbags. But I barely felt it touch my face. Honestly. Oh really? Yeah, because I think I was sitting back the whole time. That's probably why my shoulders started hurting because like um, when I hit the impact, it probably just like kind of moved me and I felt like maybe I uh, tore something or something like that. But uh, um, no big deal. That's fine now. Were you just like? Did this just happen? Like, it felt like a dream? Uh, yeah, dude. I like, what's going on? Oh, you, you were like, um, why does this always happen to me? Or, what was it? Like, what was the first thought? You said, you told me, like, you said the first thought was like, uh... Oh, oh. Well, it's more like, dude. God damn it. Son of a bitch. Alright, so not only did he also get a crash, but... Yeah, when the cops showed up, you you think they'll cut you a break, cause uh, you know, this just happened to you, and then they're just like, oh yeah, by the way, here's a ticket for careless driving. How much was the ticket? Hundred seventy bucks. 
Jeez. Three points on your license if you if you uh, you know don't take a class. What three points? Mm -hmm. Are you gonna take the class? Yeah. You got a rick. Let me also make your day even worse. Let me get you a ticket that you can't get points on your license. Now you got the M3 hood where it bumps up in the middle right here. There's a bump in the middle. <laughs> I'm literally the last one. It's a working car. Right. So a mod's car. Iqbal's car doesn't even run. We have Iqbal's CTSV LS9. So you right? think it's gonna fall? LSA. Because I'm gonna edit. <laughs> Omdrad's BMW doesn't run. I mean, I guess Muhammad's runs. This is good. Oh, by the way, it's for sale. Mark sold his uh, Challenger or Charger. I don't know why I always get those confused. Mm -hmm. But yeah, he sold that too. So I'm literally the last one left. Yeah, for a little while. In the end, Mustangs. <laughs> oh, but look at her. Okay. We're the last one in the game. Mustang. Actually, that's not true either. My clutch went out, so I was down for like a good week or so too. We've all been hit with something. Except the mods was way worse. <laughs> Alrighty guys, so unfortunately for a mod and his BMW, it ended up being totaled and the buyback wasn't worth it, so he didn't buy back the car, which is why they're grabbing it today. Um, I feel really bad, like the whole situation just sucked. Everything, like right when everything was getting good, like his tuning was starting to be, like it was good. Um, he was about to upgrade his fuel pump or fuel system, that way he can go up to 650 wheel and everything was just lining up finally for the BMW because he was having issues with tuning and everything. Every, things weren't lining up, but then at, towards the end, everything was good. Um, his car was running right, everything was good. And then all of a sudden, boom, hydroplaned into the pole. Um, the pole was pretty huge, and I think he got a ticket for reckless driving. I think he almost had to pay for that pole as well. Not 100% sure, I forgot to ask him that, but I think he told me he might have to pay for that poll as well. I'm not sure, I don't think he does, but that would suck if he did. But yeah, the poll's pretty much, it fell over and it was bent in half. It just really sucks. I, I'm just happy that everybody was okay and he was good. Came out okay, I'm just, I feel bad for his car. That was his baby. I know if that happened to me, I'd be, I'd be devastated. What? We can only get our heads, keep our heads up, look forward, new things are coming, better things are coming for sure, so I'm going to keep you guys updated as much as I can with his um, car, I think he's going to try and buy a new car, I don't know what he's going to do, he might buy a beater car for now and save up some money, but for now, he doesn't really have a car, everything's going to pan out, I, I believe it, so. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, make sure to smash like button. If you guys are not already subscribed to the channel, make sure to hit the button down below. Keep you guys updated on all of the cars that we have. Like always, guys, have a great day. Peace.